New information this afternoon, tracking stolen guns. Tonight, we're learning some of the weapons stolen from an Atoka pawn shop last month have been recovered in a stolen car. Now, three people are looking at charges. Here's WRAG Shea Arthur to explain. Boarded up after being broken into. We showed you these images after 169 guns were stolen from an Atoka pawn shop in September. While theft hurts businesses, the concern comes with what happens next to the weapons. We certainly are not necessarily concerned so much about the firearm as the firearm in the wrong hands. Someone breaking into a business like that, certainly we can believe that the firearms are going in the wrong hands. Tonight, Memphis police say two of those guns were recovered in a stolen car yesterday. That stolen Dodge Charger initially taken early yesterday morning from a home off Sharp. Then hours later, with the help of cameras in the area to spot the stolen car, officers found it in a cove off Germantown Parkway, 17 miles from where it was initially taken. Three people were inside. Two of them, now identified as Kadarian Stokes and Krishan Chisholm, took off running, but were eventually caught after a chase. A third person, Kennedy Thomas, who was a passenger, was also arrested. Shay Arthur, WREG, News Channel 3. And Thomas was released on her own recognizance. Bond information for the other two suspects was not posted.